Hello, my name is Crystal. This is for Gemini. I'm going to do your current love situation right now. And then I'm going to be doing the singles um, after this. And then I'm going to do general reading for you guys. Okay, so this is for Gemini. You have children. Children, your love life is being affected by children. So it could mean maybe you guys are having a problem being able to conceive. Maybe you guys are having issues with like baby mama, baby daddy drama. Maybe the kids are taking advantage. You could have teenager children that are taking advantage of you. You know what I mean? But kids are some type of conflict in this relationship. Um, you have ascending. Transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for a union. So you guys may be getting married, maybe getting engaged. If not um, now, it might be popping up for you in the future. Um, this just says that things are ascending for you in this relationship. You have the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Wands. This is um, new doors opening up for you. New doors. So this person might be somebody who is new. Okay, so it might be that might be the reason why you're having um, issues with the children in relationship. New relationships, we kind of like have issues dealing with like baby mom baby dad drama i'm just saying ace of wands tells me it's a new love new inspirations new ideas the ace of pentacles is new doors opening up um basically new starts okay so i feel like this person is definitely something new for you the ten of cups which is contentment happiness happy life happy wife happy family you know what i mean i feel like this person is gonna be somebody i feel like this person that you're dealing with this new person or or it could also just be somebody that you've been with for a while that you guys are you know kind of feeling like a fresh <clears throat> relationship okay but the ten of cups tells me you guys bring a lot of happiness towards each other you guys probably joke around you guys probably get along so well together you guys see the eye to eye um you have the seven of cups which is delusions illusions you know um also being confused um over some type of situation maybe you guys are confused about the children situation or maybe there's other things going on in your life in this relationship that's causing you to come to become confused let's see um what are they confused the devil. the devil okay so you might be dealing with a capricorn um but this can also just be say that you guys are confused of feeling stuck all right you guys might be feeling stuck in some type of situation some type of toxic situation it could mean um codependency somebody that has um dependent issues toxicity issues or whatever but i feel like um or you guys could be dealing with, like I said, with the children. This could be the reason why you guys are confused because maybe the baby mom and baby daddy drama might be very toxic for you guys to be dealing with, okay? For the two of pentacles for your relationship, I do feel like you guys are juggling a lot. There's a lot going on right now. But it's like this is how you guys got to figure out how to make this work, okay? I feel like it can work. You just have to make it. You just have to figure out a way how to make it work, how to see eye to eye. Maybe just have a really... Um, long conversation and be open and honest about your feelings towards this person so that way they know how to move on how to keep on continuing this relationship i don't know why i can't talk okay so for you singles we have ten of swords finality enough anxiety enough or the end of anxiety the end of depression the end of like stressful waiting and all this other stuff the page of wands i feel like there's a new message coming in for you something that's going to bring you happiness okay um this might be somebody that you know it might be somebody different but i feel like there is a new text or a new message coming in for you regarding this love um, and I feel like it's finally going to end all this stress that you have been through. The Eight of Pentacles, this is somebody that you're going to be able to work through. Work on. Work together with. <laughs> Alright, I feel like this person, this person also may be um, going to school. You may be going to school, studying and doing a lot of stuff like that. Or just furthering your education about something. You have the Page of Pentacles too. So this is good news coming in for you. You have two pages. There's definitely a new message coming in for you. It could be regarding love. It could be also regarding career since the Page of Pentacles. But this is also for single love. So I'm just saying, if you guys did um, with the Eight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles, uh, whatever you guys are working on is about to come to fruition, okay, within this love. You have not today, not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, call person, boundaries, still angry. Okay, so maybe you're mad at somebody right now or you're just not dealing with them. Um, you guys may have had an argument or something or something like this, but I feel like with the Eight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles, I feel like that, and the Ten of Swords, first of all, it's an ending to that. So I feel like whatever was needed, well, whatever was said was needed to be said, because maybe um, that's going to help you move further. Sometimes arguments are, are beneficial to us because we say things that we always held back. Okay, so I feel like maybe as long as, and, and you're avoiding this conversation with this person. This person might be texting you like crazy and you're not answering. 
Okay, then you have not enough, frustrated in a relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear, ego issues, and jealousy. All right, so you might be dealing with, you might be really jealous about this person. This could be the reason why you guys don't have an argument. Maybe you don't trust them enough, but I feel like as long as you work on that with yourself, you should be fine. You know what I mean? You just really have to trust yourself and um, trust that, you know, the universe is going to put you to where you need to be. So if this doesn't work out, just know that there is somebody else that's going to be there for you. You have very soon clearly decide what it is, what, what you want so that it comes to you now. So let the universe, let the universe know exactly what you want, who and what you want. So that way they can bring it to you because if you're confused yourself, then they're not going to know what to bring you, right? So it's going to take even longer. So it's like once you find, figure out what you want, write it down on a piece of paper if you have to, and then tell the universe exactly what you want and then leave it to them. They will get it and they will bring it to you when the time is right. Then you have to stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. So like I said, keep happy thoughts. Um, I feel like as long as you try to work together with people, it should work. If it doesn't work or, or, or if you're the only one putting in some type of you know work into the relationship and the other person isn't, then that's kind of their way of telling you uh, <laughs> what page they're really on. Okay, so I feel like you just need to pay attention to their actions and not their words. Okay, so in the past you have the Ten of Pentacles. This is a general reading. In the past it could be for career, love, money, friendship, family, whatever. Okay, Six of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. I feel like you were giving too much in some type of situation that um, you was in for a long time. Ten of Pentacles, it could have been love, it could have been career. But whatever it was, it's like you were doing all the work and you wasn't getting back what you were putting in. Okay, for your current situation. Okay, I'm going to take that too. The Five of Wands, conflict, arguments, inner conflict, the tower, lots of change, massive destruction, things are changing for you right now. You might feel like, Okay, so maybe a job may be ending, or a relationship might be ending, or you might be just coming to some type of realization, right, that's going to be able to help you open your eyes to be able to move you on the right path, right, so you're not feeling stuck, and you're not going to keep on feeling conflicted in whatever situation this is, but I feel like you are kind of trying to fight this ending that's going on right now, you're trying to fight this tower moment, but the universe doesn't play that. So you have, um, also in your current situation, you have the Nine of Cups and the Temperance card. This just tells me that, you know, you need a little patience, whatever you, you know, your wish is about to be granted the universe is just asking for a little bit of patience, also for you not to rush into anything, okay? It's like, yeah, the tower may have happened or whatever, and now maybe you might be trying to fix things and rebuild or whatever, but it's like, it takes time, okay? It takes time. So try not to rush, okay? Things will work out for you in due time. Then for your future, you have the Page of Pentacles. So you have the Page of Pentacles twice. So I do feel like if you are studying or if you're taking some type of test, you put applications in or waiting for an apartment or something like that, good news is coming in for you in the future regarding whatever this is that you've been, uh, whatever test that you've taken in, in any type of thing. The Nine of Swords is in reverse. Okay, so this just tells me it's an ending. Like I said with the Ten of Swords, it's an ending to stressful events, stressful um situations, anxiety, worries, it's like things are going to start working out for you, you're finally going to get your wish granted, it's, it's about to happen now, if that hasn't happened now, it soon will, and this is going to help relieve a lot of that stress that you're going through, and it's, yeah, in the future, you're going to be divinely guided to something better, and I feel like it has to do with this page of pentacles, this new information that's going to be coming towards you, this new message, right, that's going to bring you a lot of happiness, and you're divinely guided towards that, okay, so the universe is helping push you in that direction, um, towards happiness. So that's what I got for you guys. If you guys like my content, please like and subscribe. Thank you.